So as some of you might be aware, I am chronically ill. Um, I have some physical and mental disabilities. I uh, am dealing with what some people call seasonal uh, affective disorder. Hi everyone. Um, I know it's been a little while, but I figured I'd try to do a, a video. I can't promise how long or short it'll be, um, but uh, here I am. I was in the middle of drawing uh, the cover of the book that I'm working on for myself. It's not a commission this time. Um, and I realized I had an order. Um, so I went ahead and did that order. Since I'm done with that now, I'm going to go ahead and try to finish up the cover for my book. Right now, the working title is Thread of Emotions. It is the... Um, it is a book that I have written myself and doing all the illustrations myself. I'm trying to get this all done by the end of this month at the very latest, hopefully before then. <laughs> um, but you know how long drawing takes to do. So let's get started with that and uh, we'll see what else the day brings. I may not be able to do a lot today as I would like, but you know, that's how it is. Let's see. Well, it looks like I am done with that. As you can see here, it's um, this is the cover. I don't know yet how I'm going to do the text for the cover um, or if I'm even sticking with that text. I'd love to hear your opinions on um, the names. Um, Right now, all I can think of thread of, of emotions, um, but I'm not sure. But I think I'm really proud of this drawing. I like it. So hopefully, you know, other people do too. <laughs> all right, so what am I going to do now? I think I will take a little break from drawing for at least a few minutes. Don't know what else I need to do. Um, I could, I should probably show you all some of the items that I've been making. Oh, so in previous like shorts or reels or whatever, I've been working on the um, like the dumpling pan and all that stuff. So I'm not going to be show that, but I will show. These that I've been making, these are little, let's see if I'm gonna focus, there we go. These are little, um, in case of emergency things for your pets. Um, and they come in four colors, yellow, kind of a bluish aqua color, red, and pink. And on the back of, or inside each one, let's look at this aqua one there are stickers that you can put your phone number on the backs of these. Um, so these will be coming out, I don't know, probably around the same time as the autism stuff comes out, which is going to be sometime in March. Or I might do these early. We shall see. But I've also made a couple of items for the autism uh, release uh, for April. Um, I'm really far ahead, isn't that weird? <laughs> very, very far ahead. Um, but I have 
couple of keychains. I have this one, which is very similar to the uh, sticker. It actually is the same thing as the sticker that I have, but it's a keychain. It's a keychain. And then I also have this keychain, which is actually my favorite. Everyone deserves a voice. I love this one. It's also a keychain. And I also have a very limited quantity of these. These are pins. Um, it just says autism awareness and acceptance. Um, so I've been, these are all handmade. Um, I have the quantity that I'm going to stick with for right now, unless they do exceptionally well. Um, so let's see how many I have. Um, I make everything by hand. I think the only thing I'm not making by hand are my coloring books and um, the actual book book that I'm working on right now. I feel like the professional print just looks a lot better. So I've been doing using that for that. Um, but I'm not sure what else I need to work on. I guess I could create some um, just packs of stickers. I don't know what I want to do. <laughs> I truly don't know what I feel like doing. Or I could just take the rest of the day off. It's 1130. <laughs> It seems very early to be taking the rest of the day off. Or just take a long break. Okay, I'll see you all back here in a little while. Trying to work with a cat on you is difficult. I'm trying to work. Getting all comfortable pushing the keyboard. So I just realized that I am going to have to probably move the book launch back again, which really, really bothers me. Um, mainly because there are a lot of pictures that I have to draw. And the problem with that is each picture takes at minimum like one to two days to do. and if I wanted to get this done, printed, and ready to go by the March um, market, it's just not going to be possible without, I don't know, drive myself crazy with the amount of work. So I think this is going to have to be a 2025 release, which really, really bothers me. Um, but that's okay. Um, but that just means I need to um, really look at what I have for that market in March. Oh, well. It's kind of bumming me out a little bit, but it is what it is. Hi, everyone. Figured I would start the day in a different corner of my office today. Unfortunately, I think you can see a reflection of the window, but anyway, but this is my little corner where I have all my stuffed animals <laughs> and my plants in the window. And I have some, you can probably see these sometimes on the vlog, but this is um, my prints, a lot of my prints that I've done. So what is on the agenda today? Um, I have some non-profit stuff I need to do, um, which I will probably get to maybe. Uh, today is President's Day, so I don't technically need to be working. Um, but, you know, I don't need to work on any day that I pick, because it's my business, so I can work any day that I want to. Um, but it's also our second year anniversary, yay! <laughs> which is lovely. And I'm very excited about that. Um, we have done a lot in these two years and we've expanded a lot in these two years. Um, 
I have, I mean, I started in a tiny house um, in my bedroom, which was no bigger than pretty much this corner I'm sitting in right now. Um, so I'm happy with the progress. It's slow and steady. Um, otherwise, today I should be working on, um, excuse me, Sebi. There's nervous. Hello, nervous. <laughs> I should be working on some, um, the rest of the stickers for the autism pack. I brought some stuff that I can use to make some new items. Um, so I might work on that today and take you all along on that. But that's all I have for the day. <laughs> um, but let me show you something that I found on Canva that I thought was cute. I'm not going to show you all the tabs I have open up there, but I'm in the process of making a happy anniversary to us or happy birthday to us thing. And Canva now has these AI things or you can cartoonify things. And I took a picture of Severus or Sebi and made that. <laughs> it's so cute. Um, it doesn't really look like him, <laughs> but I think it's still cute. And we're back. So I think this will be the last thing I do um, for today. So let's change my screen. So currently I have four stickers that I just finished creating um, or almost finished creating. Um, and this is for the autism collection for this year. Um, I also have the items that I showed you earlier in the vlog. So um, I'm going to save these and set them up on a print sheet, figure out the sizes that I want for each of these. So we have this one, the Think Neuro Spicy. Let me make these bigger. Think Neuro Spicy. Then we have the Autism Graffiti one. This is the one I need to finish. I need to do some text inside of Affinity Design, and I will show you all that in a moment. Um, it's going to say treat ableism, not autism. Um, and I kind of like it. Um, and then this is my favorite one is people, not puzzles. So I have four new stickers coming out. I was originally thinking about making it into a, like a sticker bundle, but I think this time I'm just going to make them, um, into individual stickers. The main reason I decided to do the text like this versus doing the text and drawing it, because I knew it would take a lot longer. <laughs> it would take a lot longer. 
Um, and I just really wanted to be done with this. The only sticker right now that I know will be white is the Think Neuro Spicy. Um, so anyway, that is pretty much it for today. Um, and I think this is pretty much it for the vlog. I want to thank you all for joining me. I have no idea how long or short this vlog is. Um, and, uh, I'm going to try, and I don't want to make this promise lightly, I'm going to try to do more vlogs, um, or at least some longer content instead of just the shorts. I have done quite a few shorts, and thank you for all of my new subscribers for joining. Um, we are now over 300, which is fantastic. I can't believe that. But um, So I'm going to say goodbye for this week, and I hope you all are well. Um, subscribe if you want to, and press that like button really does help. Alrighty, I will see you all later. Bye.